<coughs> so it's been about um, nine days, seven days, eight days, eight days since my last stream. Uh, okay, okay, that's all good to go. Um, so yeah, it's been a little while since my last stream. Uh, this stream is going to be about two to three hours long. Um, so before I go off onto the final level and all that fun stuff, uh, there's... I like to get started by doing a dread challenge, which I never actually did. Now, I wasn't expecting to be able to, to do this right away, but then looking back, I realized that I would be able to probably be able to do it now that I have max health, well, not, not max health, but max weapon damage and all that good fun stuff. So, keeping with wrench only, uh, I'm jumping out. Immediately, come on. So yeah, I have about um, about three minutes to destroy all of these Leviathans. Yeah, it's actually not anywhere as bad as it was. And it's about a third of the time done. So yeah, like... The only problem here is that they actually run away from you. Damn it. In fact, there's enough time that I can go over here. And... Let's move the microphone over a bit. Yeah, I can go over here and grab this. Yo, you're dead. Come on. There you go. Ow. Yeah, so this one turned out to not be anywhere as difficult as I was expecting. And I'm done. That's that's that, I guess. Ratchet, uh, you, you can take the shuttle. To yeah, that's a fourth thing. So it's that. Um. Okay. All right. Okay. So, the other, well, the other, um, challenge that I want to try out to see if I can actually complete it is, oh, what was it called? Something, something, Tower of Power, uh, Higher Ground, that's the challenge name. Okay. Yeah, Higher Ground. Um, I did both of these in a previous stream, uh, and 
perfect chrome finish is not a challenge I feel like doing. Um, Ratchet. Okay. Right, so the part of this challenge which is difficult is... Ah, oh, they only do one damage. Huh, <laughs> noise. You die. Come on. Yeah, man. That's not shooting me at all. Okay. And also get across to here, which is fine. And then some enemies spawn over here. Now. Yeah. So. Okay, so the main thing here, I think, is to bait these enemies um, over to the land. I can't even hit you. Are you getting closer so I can, like, you know? Okay. It might only require not killing all the enemies, I think. Oh. Okay. Okay. Let's see if this works. Oh, it does. Great. <laughs> yeah, this challenge is a lot easier than I thought. Um, aside from those enemies there, which are floating above. I can get them though. Oh no, whatever will I do? Wow, that's a lot of... Oh! Okay. Killing the Vyther and enter challenge. Okay. So... Yeah, that was hugely easier. Uh. Okay. Now that I've done that, let's take a peek here. Your heroic Yay, I'm presence one. rattles my friction sensor. Uh huh. Okay. Three hundred and forty-six thousand dread points, sixty-one skill points, uh, thirty-four-seven win-loss ratio. All of those. Five hundred forty-six tri-spike swarmers. 
1.4 thousand claw tooth swarmers, 600 rhino swarmers, 255 strikers, 147 berserkers, 241 vipers, 178 stingers, 99 annihilators, 179 ghost strikers, 200 executioners, which is pretty good, 36 ghost executioners, um, 462 robot zombies, 660 shriekers, nearly a thousand blade balls, 200 cycloids, 340 tremors, 58 reapers, 130 leviathans, um, 95 laserbacks, 9 land stalkers, which is going to increase a bit, 34 70 mm stalker turrets, 157 drop chips, 180 beam turrets, 80 missile turrets, um, and all these shots are from the challenges which use these weapons. You are now the highest ranked contestant in Dread Zone history. Yay! Okay, so all that's left to do. Um, I also you'll know you'll have noticed that my HP was at 61, whereas when I left in the last drink it was 55. Uh, that's because I did a bit of grinding off off camera to get my health up a bit higher. I was aiming to get up to about 75, but I that wasn't really going to happen, practically speaking, uh, from grinding the past challenges. So yeah. Now we have a choice. There's the arena, and the control level. The control level is a one-way path, as seen here. Attention! Tempering with the in-flight control system has been detected. In accordance with Dread Zone flight regulations, this shuttle will deactivate upon arrival at the Battle Dome. Should you choose to travel to the Battle Dome, be advised there will be no transportation back. Would you like to travel to the Battle Dome now? And I say, sure. What could go wrong? This is unskippable. Clank, come in. Can you hear me? Something just doesn't seem right here. Not good. Well, well, well! What have we here, Dread Zone fans? A contestant attempting to sabotage the Battle Dome? How exciting! If he succeeds, the rest of the contestants go free! But if he fails, I've wired the Battle Dome with six gigatons of nitroglycerin. If Ratchet doesn't disarm the detonator before time runs out, the Battle Dome will be blown into a tree in pieces! That's insane! Au contraire! If I was still on the Battle Dome, then it would be insane. But I happen to have a truly lovely view of the action from a remote location. What about the thousands of fans in the Battle Dome? You gonna kill all of them too? Of course not! You are! Unless you shut your cake hole and get moving. Go on now. Your audience is waiting. <laughs> Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to, uh, to the final episode of Dread Zone. Oh, God, we're all gonna die. Uh, um, the mood is positively electric as the audience braces to find out if they will survive the next ten minutes. I can't believe I'm reading this. I had my whole life ahead of me. <laughs> I was gonna be a ballet dancer. Pull yourself together, you blabbering idiot! <sighs> Thank you, Juanita. Superstar contestant Ratchet faces his toughest challenge yet to deactivate the Battle Dome's formidable defense systems and defeat Gleeman Vox himself. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank Ratchet for being such a great role model and a pillar of our community. If anybody can save us, it's you, Ratchet. 
We're rooting for your little buddy. All righty. I am so sorry, Ratchet. I did not realize I yeah, was leading so you another one of Boxer's traps. There is still a way out, though. Shut up, Crank. If you can destroy the three fusion generate. Well, let's go in here. Do we get a wrench upgrade now? No, we don't. Okay. Because on That's a control fine. level, it will release the escape shuttles, and both the fans and the heroes will be saved. Well, yeah, so you'll notice that I started this mission with about 8 minutes and 40 seconds. Um, oh, I can reset. Okay. I don't need to. Death abuse. Yeah, so, you know, you're supposed to start off uh, with... Uh, a full 10 minutes. There you go. Uh, we that and we that. All that should go. There you go. Come on. There we go. Okay. Okay. Will be blown to bits any moment. So, okay, so even though this challenge. Okay, uh. Double hack. Uh, ow, I need to. If you can EMP that, it'll be great. Thank you. I'll. That. Okay. So I'll reappear at some point. Okay, and the ships. Come on, Ratchet, you can do it. If you can't, we'll all Ow. die. I kind of need to take them on. Uh, if you can destroy it, it'll be fine. Oh, and it's there at the end. Okay. Whoop. Okay. So yeah, that's basically my strategy. I did my thing. Uh, and I don't want to use up. Uh, oh, there's one down. Sweet. Focus on the other. There we go. Now, bots. Don't kill me. Thank you. Okay, first things first. Kill all the enemies. Okay. Now, you want a fried or salty? Okay, that's one down. Two. Get back up. I need it to be a distraction. Three. Four. Okay. Do that and I'll take it. Oh, 
faith. Actually, wasn't. Now deactivate the second generator, but hurry, yeah. time is running out. It wasn't anywhere near as hard as I was expecting. The main hard part that I was anticipating was actually those um, laser things, because if you don't destroy them, they'll destroy your robots, and you won't be able to destroy the explosive primer thingy. So yeah, now that I know that I can actually take take those out from the ground, this is actually looking a bit more possible. Okay. Tonight, on a very solemn episode of Dread Zone, everybody dies. Oh, no. Everybody I'm dies. Embarrassing yourself. <laughs> Mommy, I don't want to go bye bye. Okay, these Dallas, guys. This it's not the time! Thank you. Baby, you're a baby. Two, three. Baby. Your EMP that. Good boy. Ooh, okay. I'm gonna get a health upgrade soon. You are a selfish, selfish man. Thank you, Juanita. Your searing dose of verbal abuse was refreshing. Yeah, what's I this? This is the hacky. No, nope, it's just the open door. Okay. Ratchet, you are running out of time. The generators are overloading. I'm fine, Clank. <laughs> Take you out. There you go. Okay. Several escape shuttles are leaving the battle dome. Keep working, Ratchet. Okay, and that's oh no, that's a blurry thingy. Okay. Yeah. Okay, and we have one of these guys. If I kill all the laser backs, we go more. We go. Did it? Yep. Let that guy heal up. Oh. Did healing up really spawn a laser back? Ah. Uh,
really going to do this. Because I can't take out these guys fast enough. Really? Let these guys live. Nothing else spawns. Don't kill the blade balls. I need them to live. Yes! Okay. There going to be a thingy here? Nope! Okie dokie. I suppose since we're all about to perish horribly, I should own up to a few things. First of all, Timmy Aberdeen, I'm the one who set your backpack on fire. I'm sorry you couldn't get it off in time. And Susie Binkleton, I was the one who put the Tyranoid in your locker. Hey, right the therapy is going well, though. Chin up, kid! Ooh. And finally to you, Juanita, my dear. Maybe the XP from I apologize the... for the last six years of rude jokes, harassing innuendo, and all those friendly little I think I'll the actually have all these enemies killed before I move on. Because Um those that Yep. These things here are easily the most dangerous part of the game. Ratchet, can you pick up the pace, please? And the I survived. Seconds away from exploding. Oh, okay, that one. And I seem to recall the enemies from the last uh, explodey section not infinitely spawning. So, yeah. Now, hello! Once again. Oh no, eight minutes remaining. Whatever will I do? Uh, not that angle, that angle. Okay. Sweet! Uh, okay. Right. Is it? I could just actually grind against these guys. Um, well, that's a problem. <laughs> yeah, I could just repeatedly kill these guys as much as possible to get as much XP out of them as I can. Ow. Apparently so. Okay. Oops. Yep. There you go. Uh huh. Two down. Did one of them get destroyed already? Uh, 
Okay. They'll do one. How much health is around? There's a crate over there. Crate over there. Wait, are no more enemies spawning? If so, I'm gonna take that extra health just in case. Yeah. The enemy. This is easily the easiest of the three. Like, the previous one took a bit less time, sure. But this one is the easiest. Because at the end, nothing attacks you! <laughs> Okay. Well done, Ratchet. The containment fields are deactivated. The station is no longer on lockdown. Good. Now get on a shuttle and get out of here. Sorry, Ratchet. I am not leaving without you. Oh, for the love of blog! Cut out the sappy melodrama before you lose my entire audience! <laughs> I've been waiting for this moment for a long time. I'm gonna give Dread Zone fans the finale they've been waiting for. It's a little one-act play I call Death of the Lombats. <laughs> and here we go. It's time to put you in So this is the final fight against the Vox. Uh I I don't want to load. Thank you very much. I'm going to save. Save there. And there. Okay. I'm going to save over there again so that it will autom automatically save over the top file. The syndication. So they'll make it. Easier. Now, how much? Okay. You little rat! I should have popped the your top four actually do decent ago. damage against that guy. Oh, looks like Box has some tricks up his sleeve. This is gonna be one mm. heck of a match. I think that could have been better, but... Considering that we die if Team Darkstar loses, that's an understatement. Yeah. An understatement, an undergarment, the underworld of professional mustache twirling, whatever it is, it's hot! So yeah, I can't I'm actually character for just a second and say, attack... Watch out! If you don't, we all die! I can't actually attack Vox right now. Box, eat this! But the fortunate thing is that my bot... Oh yeah, this is basically waiting for my bots to Here, do enough Dr. damage to um You got a prize! Time to collect! <laughs> and about half health. At about half health, uh, he goes into his second phase. Oops, that. Do your worst bots. Here's a ratings poster. Okay, so it seems like his attacks might be somewhat random. I'm 
Yeah, that seems to be uh, the basic stuff behind this. Nobody saw that one coming. It's called a twist. Uh, so, the audience wants a show. I'll give him a show! Okay, and he actually... Okay. Right. Now... Ah, I'm actually attacking. That's alright. Oh. I always like close fights. Well, I lost a chance, so... Okay. Right. Oops. Behold the miracle of holographic technology. The galaxy's greatest warriors digitally rebroadcast for your destruction. Oh no. The only time you're going to be seen again is in reruns. Whoop. Get him, get him. Oh, no. this could be disaster there we disaster. go, okay. I put 500 bolts on this That's man. his second phase. Dallas, um, hanging the balance and you are gambling? And I don't even need the health at all. Oh, don't pretend like you care. You okay. cared! Oh, go, oh, there we go. I popped a blood vessel again. Oh, all right, can somebody oh, get the over there. Here's a third act twist. The big bad guy Whoop. just got bigger. This year on Trenzo, an audience favorite, Whoop. the giant map climactic battle. I can't look. His team dogs are dead. Dallas, what's happening? Dallas, what are you doing? <laughs> Nothing. Just keep your eyes closed. Go. Yeah. We'll see you in the reruns. Okay, so this seems like it won't actually have been. Lunchbox, eat this. That's right. Now. Make you all team dark star. Destroy him. Destroy his family. Make him cry into his next life. Yeah! Okay. I've never seen that before, ladies and gentlemen. Juanita has eaten the cameraman. Whoop. Am I gonna have to face this in the first try? It's called a twist. Oh, it's good to be the boss. If I don't like someone, I just do this. Okay. The galaxy's greatest warriors digitally rebroadcast for your destruction. Show's over, Lombax. Thanks for playing. Yes. Time to bump up the action. Okay. Yes! Come on. Yes! Yes, 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 yes! 
It's over, Vox. No! <laughs> but it will be soon. Destruct sequence initiated. 60 seconds until Battle Dome detonation. The escape shuttles all left long ago. <laughs> now we'll both die together on live Holovision. <laughs> It'll be the best ratings I've ever had! Even if I don't make it out of here alive, at least a lot of other heroes escape tonight. <laughs> Enjoy your pathetic idealism <laughs> for the last few seconds of your life. What? Get in, Ratchet. There is no time remaining. Just a sec. <laughs> Hold still, Ratchet. Whoa! <laughs> Check out that explosion! That was awesome! <laughs> Let's do it again! Move! It's my turn to look! No, it's my turn, you little brats! Get out of here! Don't you know how to respect <laughs> your elders, hmm? Ow! Did you see what she just... Ah! Ah! <laughs> what? If this was the last shuttle, what else could I do? Hey, I fixed the comm link. We've got incoming calls. Ratchet, Clank. Hey, it's Kid Nova. What can I say? I thought I was a goner back there. I owe you guys big time. Hey, Ratchet, it's Hydra Girl. If you're ever back in Aquatos, promise you look me up, okay? Ah, well, uh, Aquatos is nice this time of year. Well, why not? More calls coming in! Ratchet, Blank, <laughs> it's me, Captain Quark. There's a nasty rumor going around about heroes being kidnapped. But don't worry, it's baloney! I mean, come on, nobody came to capture me, right? Just imagine making a show about galactic heroes without Captain Quark! Ha! Well, anyway, you guys missed the last three meetings of the Quark Cadets fan club. Well, oh, don't worry. I've got extra copies of the newsletter, and I even saved some of the snacks. Hope you like custard. So yeah, that was deadlocked. Ranch and bots only. Um, yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. Hmm. So. Okay. Uh. Yeah. Now that I've finished, wrench and bots only quite easily. <laughs> uh. I mean, it wasn't quite easily. I, as you probably saw, I just barely completed it. Um, like I had, oh, okay, yeah, like I had um, two health out of about 63 remaining at the end there. Uh, I think once, I'm pretty sure once. Vox goes down, then, um, then basically, yeah, once, once, once Vox goes down, 
Um, ooh, my step. Once Fox Stoke goes down, there's like three or four seconds before the cutscene plays. And I'm pretty sure within that window, it is actually possible to die and to have to redo the fight all over again. Um, I'm pretty sure that's a thing. So, yeah, it's not over until the cutscene plays. Um, as for what's next for this game, uh, hmm, so, uh, right, so I'll just mention a thing that I did in Ratchet and Clank 3 that could be interesting to try out here um, and basically in Ratchet and Clank 3 I recorded a playthrough where I went through New Game Plus from a complete fresh save without purchasing any mega weapons so I was only able to use the non mega weapons right I couldn't upgrade them beyond the point where they become mega for example um, so I didn't put the hair back here in the title Okay, so I can do a similar thing for this game, basically, uh, where I go through New Game Plus without buying Mega Weapons. Um, yeah. So, uh, like, so the rules of this playthrough um, would basically be, um, you know, do it without getting any mega weapons, but the new game plus bots upgrades and wrench upgrades are okay. Um, Dr. Nefarious. Yeah. And um, Are going to get the cutscene? Yeah? Yeah, pretty soon. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, so... Uh, it could be an interesting, an interesting thing to try out, but given that it, when I did it in Ratchet and Clank 3, it was really easy, except for the end when it was like a really big difficulty spike. Um, for this, it would be interesting to try it out in Exterminator difficulty. Um, now that I have that difficulty on this on this memory card. Um, uh. So, you know, it, it could 
it'll be a thing to try, and if it if it's fun, then it'll be interesting, and if it's if not, then he will return one of these days. Here we go. Cutscene. Hey. Lawrence, what's going on? You said we were coming within range of a space station. Well, we were, sir. How was I to know it would suddenly explode? Oh, Janice. It's been so long. Too long. Say you'll never leave me again for that nasty villain, Engelbert. You make me feel like a young boy again. Say what? So, start game over in challenge mode. Yes. Okay. And once again, I'll be skipping the cutscenes. There we go. All right, Ratchet. Your movement circuit should be in working order now. Try getting to the top of that ledge. Huh. I am transmitting a digital mini-map representation of the area. Can you see it? The mini-map will show you the positions of nearby enemies. I am reading three more hollow targets in your vicinity. Huh. Remember at the very start of the run <coughs> when when like getting through the few and oh, I need damn it. Damn it. For some reason, it always... Okay, that'll do for now. Yeah, so... In New Game, it starts the right off the bat the with you having to enemies. shoot... I am reading three more hollow targets in your vicinity. I know. Yeah, so... It has, um... Two or three things that you are sitting right here on, and you have to shoot them. Um, you know, bang, you can expand your bang, any time to get a bang. View of the area. Yes, I know. Um, the mini map will show you the positions of nearby enemies. I am reading three more hollow targets in your vicinity. Uh huh. Yeah. So. Um, the way you'd get around that uh, is by doing this in New Game Plus. There's still the other two challenges which would need to you would need to get around if you were to do a 100% wrench only playthrough. Um, you'll need to get around those other two challenges. Uh, and find a way to use the environment to kill all of the enemies, which is not a thing that is easy, because in some of those rounds, there's no environmental hazards aside from the lava. And the big bots don't walk into the lava because of an invisible wall. Um, so, yeah. So I'm going to save here.
and here. Okay. Looks a bit weird, but okay. Um, and I'm going to load right now, right on this section before I've done anything on this save file. Yes, exterminator. Yeah. And I'm going to give it a go, doing this without trying mega weapons uh, on exterminator. But before I do that, I'm going to need to stop and start the stream, so that you will need to double jump to reach that ledge. Yep. So I'll stop and start the stream so that I can change the title of the stream. So yeah. I will be back in a little bit. See you then.